Tries. Hi everyone and welcome to Rat Tries 32. I've got my best friend here, Nagonuts. Hi folks. And uh, we're going to do something different. We're going to go back to the snack related products. Yeah. And on this episode, we're going to try out new kettle ridge cut barbecue beef brisket forever. So we're going to try these out. And for those people out there who are gluten intolerant, yeah. the good news is these are gluten free. So you don't need to worry about no. or anything like that. Now, I'm a bit biased towards kettle because I love their crisps. Yeah. Especially the sea salt and that side of vinegar ones. Yeah. They normally do. And they're, okay, it's really salty, but they're still good. Really sort of crisps right. as well. You know, they're normally like packs like this. They're not yeah. like you can get like a six pack where they're about half of that. Yeah, half of that. Like like a Walker's crisp bag. Yeah. All lazy if you're in America. And you normally get a six pack of them. I think you can get two really salted, two of the sea salt side of it, and two like the what was it, spring onion or something? Cheese and cheddar. Yes. On, cheddar yeah, onion two, yeah, two of the onion type things. And they normally do these like big ones as well. Yeah. So again we're gonna we're trying experiment with different camera angles so I hope this one is good yeah I hope this one's good viewing angle and the lighting is okay I am at a certain point in time folks gonna get a more up-to-date camera um, because I just bring up brought these new ones now especially logo tech yep. this man's the old C920 uh, it's all right but it's they brought a new one now for actual streamers or people who use YouTube but it's slightly out of my price range but it's not too expensive, so hopefully in the next few months I should be able to get it, and then you should see improvement. Because on that one, you can like actually integrate it with XSplit or OBS, so you can have like different background images in the background. Oh, right. so in theory, I should be able to have like a background of the game we're playing in the background whilst we're playing it as well. So oh, that, right. that'd be so, so awesome to see, won't it? Yeah. But I need to get to grips with that first because I'm still getting used to OBS itself. Remember. I'm new <laughs> to all this stuff, so let's stop jibber jabbering and get these tried. Yeah. Right, first, as always, the smell test. Now, these aren't normal kettle because these are ridge cut, a bit like McCoy's. Alright, yep. So, smell that. Mm. It's not overpowering at no, all, is it? It's no. not like. No. Not shot for six, but is the taste good? Let's find out. Okay, it's not a puny one. <laughs> Just a diddy on that one. Mm, what do you think? It's not winning me over, but it's probably just me. They're okay, but they're not bam it you in the face yeah, and not, yeah. not me over I think I know why I'll tell you in a minute I just have one more mm. yeah you have one more as well yeah. I think I know why yeah. now the reason is these are winning me over is because I've had nothing I would say similar but remember Walkers or Lay's bought all those barbecue one crisps, remember? Oh yeah. yeah. All it is, that's like a barbecue type taste. And because this one tastes a bit like barbecue, it's like, well, being there done that kind of thing, you know, I've had the barbecue type crisp before. Not in a, exactly like this. No. Uh, or in a ridge cut, like a normal potato cut crisp, but it's still like barbecue flavor. So it's not as if I'm having a barbecue type flavor for the very first time. No. And I thought with these, at least these would have been a bit more special yeah. kind of thing. But it's like, yeah, and a little bit more nice than a normal like Walker's barbecue for crisp, but I can't really tell that much of a difference. No. And to be honest, when you when you eat one, you can't taste the beef. No. Just the barbecue, what do you think? I can't taste beef at all. Mm, no, it's the barbecue, isn't it? Yeah, it's got smoked paprika in it. Mm. Let's read the ingredients. It says it's got roast beef brisket powder in it, but 
I can taste more of the ground black pepper than anything. Guess what's got in it as well? Yeah. Yeah, so um, if you're the type of person who likes his barbecue to act crisps and you want more than just a single bag of Walker's barbecue flavor and you want it in a ridge cut as well and you're a fan of kettle, then yeah, I highly recommend these. However, if you're looking for something for its namesake, actual beef, go somewhere else. Yeah. Yeah. So one more for the road? Yeah. Yeah. They're okay for yeah, what they are. I mean, they're okay, but you would have thought with the name like this, you would have thought expecting something better. Being bowled over a bit more. Yeah, like, wow, they're really good, kind of thing. I'm mm. having some of all them. So the next episode is going to be kettle again, but these are like new, like, cuisine type oh, really crisps good. they brought out. Two, two of them, well, three of them, but one of them I didn't really like the look of because it's like chilly in it. Mm, I don't like no, 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 like spicy purse. Yeah, so you just entertain the audience while I just go and get them. Because oh, I, I, I forgot to show them, didn't I? <laughs> no mind, yeah. Well, so we're just going to get these out and show you folks yeah. what's going to be appearing. So these two are the next ones we're going to do on the next episode. I'm not going to say the names of them because, well, it's a bit, bit hard. It's a bit of a mouthful. <laughs> yeah. So those two on the next episode. So that's forward to isn't it? Definitely yeah so again um hope you enjoyed this episode yeah. please let me know in the comment section below what you thought of it and if you're viewing me for the first time then hey and you can support me by subscribing to my channel yes and i've got a facebook page as well just search for yoki rap productions so that's it so we'll see you guys and girls later bye bye, bye.